Well, this is a region that really loves its football, the industrial west of Germany. We're at the home of Borussia Dortmund. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League group stage action to look forward to. It is Borussia Dortmund facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, this has the makings of a very good game. Great atmosphere, some top-class players and a perfect pitch. I'm excited by this one. And here's the 11 for Borussia Dortmund. Rafael Guerrero starts with Thomas Meunier as fullbacks. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And this Champions League group stage contest commences. Laporte. De Bruyne, Bernardo Silva, a meaty but fair challenge and it will be a throw-in. Gundogan, Alvarez, well read to ease the pressure. Anthony Modest, now with Bellingham. And this is Royce. A bit of pressing. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. So, glancing at the table, and I must say, when the teams came out of the various pots for the Champions League draw, this was the one that stood out straight away. What a riveting game this promises to be. Well, you're absolutely right, Derek. This should be a great game. I'd expect both these teams to go deep into the competition. This is the Champions League at its best. Let's hope we're not disappointed. Oh, he saved it well. And deciding to go short with this one. Foden. And now Rodri. High quality defending. to be he had moved into an illegal position well it's great that he wants to run in behind but he has to get the timing right well Kevin De Bruyne one of the complete midfield players in the modern game Stuart what do you expect we'll see from him this time around well Derek we know he loves linking up with other players but it's when he's in and around the penalty area that's when he's at his most dangerous when he plays little one twos around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner he could be the key to unlocking this defense Possession one. 
Foden on to Gundogan Phil Foden now well they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing can he put them in front Zula stops it It's a short one. Rodri. Now Gundogan. No way through. De Bruyne. On to Walker. Gundogan. And now Rodri. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. Gundogan. Doesn't come as a huge surprise. Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. And so the game back in business, City ahead here. He's got to score! Well, not a million miles away from the equaliser. Well, he couldn't quite get it on target, but at least they're making chances now. Pot. It's with Gundogan. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Gundogan. De Bruyne now. De Bruyne. Gundogan. Foden. And now Rodri. De Bruyne. And back with Rodri. De Bruyne. Can he do it? And still a chance. And there it is. A goal. I must say, much to the annoyance of the keeper. Well, let's take another look at this. And from the attacking point of view, everything's right. The shot across the goalkeeper, players coming in for the rebound, and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that. He made a good effort on the first one, couldn't react to the second. With the scoreline standing at 2-0. Good tackle. Shot attempted and blocked for now. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will they profit from this situation? Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal! What a magnificent display! It's such a one-sided contest here. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. But I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. Well, the action underway again. So comfortable for City, it's turning into a trouncing. Well, as you can see, the visitors have had most of the ball, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Joao Cancelo. Manchester City have lost the ball. A City free kick forthcoming. They know they need to stop him. Rodri. On to Silva. The ball with Rodri. 
Walker. Now with Silva. Is it going to be? He had to react and did. A real opening now. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments and he's proved it yet again. Guerrero with the corner. That's going to be all for the first half here in the Ruhr region. So back underway here, and after the happenings of the first half, Borussia Dortmund really need to lift themselves. Superb block. De Bruyne. It's with Gundogan. Bernardo Silva has it. Determined defending. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they keep it going? Targets available. Cross comes in. Well, it came to nothing in the end. A lot to look forward to on the Champions League group stage front here on EA TV Live. It's Borussia Dortmund facing Manchester City. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams. He has teammates around him and a body in the way. Rodri. Here's Alvarez. Gundogan. And here's Cancelo. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Well, nicely cut out. Silva Walker 30 minutes left for play just a quick reminder we've got Champions League group stage action for you to look forward to here on EA TV it's oh, Kenny score here Derek another goal the lead grows to four now a rampant display Well, just look at this. He's so alive for the situation. That's a neat-headed goal in the end. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Anthony Modest. Determined defending. They've got it now. What can they do? A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. De Bruyne. Walker now. Bernardo Silva. Kevin De Bruyne on to Silva Rodri Joao Cancelo the ball with Rodri able to skip past his man Rodri and return to De Bruyne Ball 
with Rodri. Rodri. Onto De Bruyne. Well, he took care of it defensively. De Bruyne. Not a good tackle. Will he find the net? Chance for Gundogan. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Gundogan. Gundogan. Here's De Bruyne. Look, look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Cancelo and back with Rodri De Bruyne now with Gundogan splendid defending and it needed to be Marco Reus it's with Modest and Bellingham but still a chance and he gobbles up the second chance disappointment for the keeper no wonder he's asking questions of his defence well as you can see the first save is a good one but they can't react quickly enough to the second ball the keeper's a bit unlucky really five minutes to go Alvarez it's with Gundogan Rodri Here's Alvarez The ball with Rodri Precise ball movement Rodri De Bruyne Oh great defending And under pressure That was a fine claim the referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Mini eight. And this is Reus. And that is that full time here and a win for City. Your verdict. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening and they played really well. What a performance that was today. And now Rodri.